of kids are helping to honor our military heroes. Tuesday is National Medal of Honor Day, celebrating the military's highest honor. Those whose family tree stretches all the way back to the foundation of Colorado Springs took part in that ceremony today. Radio News Channel 13's Carl Winder gives us a look. General William Palmer can be seen mounted on his horse looking over Colorado Springs on Platte and Nevada with his high school next to him. But the children of the American Revolution decided to remember the founder in a different way. He was the founder of Colorado Springs, did the uh, engineering on the train. Thomas Jenkins and Seamus Rupke placed a wreath on Palmer's grave to honor him. The remembrance of what he did. Palmer received his Medal of Honor after he and his troops captured more than a hundred Confederate soldiers without losing a man during the Civil War in Alabama. It's a great feeling because those are children who have a background and heritage that goes back to the Revolution. Gloria Hamilton runs the group. She feels the kids should learn about America's heroes since they have family ties to the American Revolution. To have them still remember him with um, some degree of honor and respect, I think is very important. Hamilton says the group is planning on placing wreaths on the headstone of each Medal of Honor recipient in the city next year. In Colorado Springs, Carl Winder, KRDO News Channel 13. The group also honored private first class Floyd Lindstrom. Colorado is home to three of more than 70 Medal of Honor recipients who are still alive.